Ooh, I'm super excited for this. Hi guys. Hi, I hope you're ready for this 23 question interview. Yeah, I'm super excited. First, can you introduce yourself and where we are right now? Yeah, my name is Aaliyah. I'm a member of Arnett Hall Council, which is a group of students that plans events for the freshmen. Right now we are in Arnett Hall, which was built in 2014. And this is the lobby where students get to hang out and study. Ooh, a fireplace and a piano? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. I noticed that RA sign over there. What does that mean? Yeah, so the RA sign is for, um, it lets you know who is going to be on call, and on call means that they are here to answer your um, calls if there is an emergency, and they are available from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m., seven days a week. So, Aaliyah, what specific thing do you love the most about Arnett? I love just how relaxing Arnett Hall is, and it's just like a great place to hang with your friends if you want some downtime. What's one thing most people would be most surprised to know about Arnett Hall? Yeah, um, Arnett Hall, even though it is relaxing and fun, we do have a a lot of crazy and fun times here and we can get pretty rowdy. Can you share some of the features our net hall has? Yeah, so right here is the laundry room and it's a pretty spacious laundry room and even though it doesn't seem like a lot of washing machines, they don't get crowded. And right here is the Arnett gym, which although it might seem a little small, it's perfect for the amount of residents that we have. Nice. What are some of the perks to living in Arnett? Yeah, um, so we do have private garages, which are great to keep your cars out of the elements like snow or rain. Each um, floor has its own communal kitchen, which is also really nice. So you can cook and hang out with your friends. Um, another great thing about Arnett is that it is very close to the library. Demeray Hall, which is one of the um, academic halls, as well as Gwyn, which is a great place to eat and hang out with your friends. You mentioned Gwyn. What is your favorite meal at Gwyn? Yeah, my favorite meal at Gwyn would have to be whenever they do Hawaiian night, which is um, just like really great because even though we live in Seattle, <laughs> we don't have access to a lot of really good Hawaiian food. So it's really nice when Gwyn puts it on because it's like a taste of Hawaii. That sure does sound tasty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey there. Oh my gosh, Emma, hi. This is Emma, she's another member of Arnett Hall Council. Hi Emma, do you think you could answer some questions? Yeah, of course. Which song would be Arnett's theme song? I would have to say, It's a Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood from Mr. Rogers. I love that song. Do you have a favorite memory from living in Arnett? Hmm, there's a lot of great ones, but I think one of my favorites is from last year. My friends and I would have Monday night dance parties. So for like five minutes every Monday night, we turn on some music and dance, take a break from studying, and just have some fun. Oh, I think I forgot something in the study room. Wow, these study rooms are super nice. Where's your favorite hangout spot in our net? Well, I have to be honest, one of my favorite spots to go is the stairwell because it's a quiet place to make a phone call or cry if you need to, I don't know. <laughs> Another one of my favorite spots is the deck on fifth floor. It's a beautiful place uh, to study, just hang out and relax. I can sh take you there if you want. I'd love that. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to bump into you. I guess I just got too excited to see your favorite hangout spot. No worries, we'll see it in a minute. Hey, Precious. Hey, Emma. Oh, whoa, is this a 23 questions? Yeah, it is. You want to join us? Yeah, it sounds like fun. Precious, do you have a favorite Arnett Hall event? It would be our end of the year bonfire. In the past year, it's usually at Golden Gardens, which is a local beach in Seattle, and it has the prettiest sunset. It's my favorite because it's one of the last events in our hall, and we get to have like the last meal and like roast marshmallow with our residence hall, and it's a bittersweet moment. How would you describe our next culture in three words? It's inclusive, it's fun, and diverse. Can you describe living at Arnett in three words? It's community-based, private, and friendly. And what do you think is the secret to having a fun and fulfilling college experience? Be able to manage your time and listen, live in the resident hall if you can because you meet a lot of amazing people and create a lot of memories with your floor and your roommate. Oh, I almost forgot to ask. Can you tell me more about the rooming options in Arnett? Sure. Actually, hey, I can show you my room right here. Ooh, that would be awesome. 
Majority of the rooms in Arnett are usually double rooms shared between you and your roommate, and it comes with a private bathroom, which is shared between your room and one other room. Ooh, that's really sweet. And I actually live in the nook, so which is why I have a walk-in hallway before getting to my room. And one of the perks of living in the nooks is a walk-in closet, which each floor only has one nook in their floor. And I, I get to live in a room with a pretty view of the canal, and I also get a view of the canvas from this window. And all of these furnitures are movable, and you can bunk your beds or you can unbunk them however you like. And we added some decorative on our walls to make it more homey. Oh, it's such a nice room. Uh, Emma, I think you got a text. Oh, yeah, you're right. It's Aaliyah. She says, what's your favorite thing about your floor? I guess I would have to say that my favorite thing about my floor is getting to spend time with my friends and floor mates. We've made some awesome memories. And what's something you know about Arnett that no one else knows? Hmm, the vending machine in the laundry room. Sometimes it'll give you an extra candy or snack for the price of one. And if Arnett had a personality, what would it be? Well, judging by the Myers-Briggs test, I would have to say that Arnett would be an INFJ. And can you, one of you tell me a funny story that happened while living in Arnett? On one of the nights, one of my floormates decided to make popcorn for a movie night. Long story short, that's the reason why our microwave is yellow <laughs> and it smelled like burnt popcorn for three days straight and we had to like bring out the microwave like out here. So here we are at um, my favorite place in Arnett, the rooftop balcony. I think the views out here are incredible. Wow, these are incredible views. Yeah, it's great. Hey, here they are over here. Hey, Emma. Hey guys, how's it going? It's going good. If you guys look behind you, there's a poster board. Oh, <laughs> nice. Wow. Precious, can you write down your favorite word to describe our net? Sure, put this marker right here. Aww. Aww. Aaliyah, can you draw Arnett's spirit animal? Yeah. Cute. An elephant. And Emma, can you write down a nickname you have for Arnett? Our nations. That's what we call our residents. Okay, we're on our last question. What is the best piece of advice you would give to an incoming freshman? I would tell the freshman to join clubs once you get to SVU. Really put yourself out there and be a part of the SVU community because it's a great way to feel like you belong here at SVU as well as make a ton of new friends. That was great. Thank you guys for guiding me through our net. Thanks for coming. Bye. See you guys later. Bye. Bye. Thank you.